friends. friends. Welcome back. So today we're here at Animal Kingdom. Yes. I am so excited. We're just going to have a chill day, kind of Animal Kingdom, see where the day takes us. Yep. We don't really necessarily have any crazy plans. We don't have Genie Plus. We're kind of just going to bounce around the park, see what we could do. The park is a little bit busy, kind of, by the looks of it right now, but we're still going to have an amazing day, and I'm we are both very excited for it. Yeah. So. so let's get in there. All right, so we're gonna head into Riverside Depot and see if we can find any new merch. So much of the Wish merch is on sale for 40% off, and you can stack that with your annual pass too. So you can get some of this merch for a pretty good deal. I haven't seen any of this line in the parks so yet. Yeah, this is the first time. We have a little long sleeve, and there's also a bucket hat too with the same print on it. We've got a hoodie. This is probably my favorite, is the teal crew neck. That's really cute. They also have the same one in a gray color. This is another fun new collection with like the cute tie-dye pastel print. This one's really fun. But while we're here, I wanted to show you guys the new dog, Dooney and Burke one. I am obsessed with these, but there's no way I'll spend $200 on a pair of ears. But they're so cute. All right, we're gonna head over to Isles of Java and grab my favorite breakfast sandwich. I'm gonna show you guys one of our favorite quiet little spots to come sit. It's actually to the left of Flame Tree Barbecue. And there is a million seats over here that are always available with some great views. All right, and just like that, we get to have breakfast with this incredible view. And there's absolutely, well, there's Kyle. <laughs> there's absolutely nobody around us. It's amazing. <laughs> we got a surprise visit from Nico and Pocahontas. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do Expedition Everest at a 25 minute wait. All right, so that was way longer than 25 minutes. So we're gonna go do single riders and it's literally a walk on for single riders. <laughs>
So we were able to do Everest twice yep. in less than 15 minutes. Yeah, probably less than 10 minutes. Like. Yeah, but that was so much fun. We love doing single ride on Everest because it really is the best. Yeah, and like we were just talking about it, like it kind of is cool because you get to experience it. It's like we love experiencing it together, obviously, but like kind of get to meet new people and new families yeah, and see fun. how they're experienced throughout Animal Kingdom and the parks. Itself. I love getting to ride with the little kids and oh, they get so excited. It's, it's so fun. But yeah, I think we're going to keep walking. And we're just having a chill day, so we'll yep. update you next hear, time we do something. I hear some live entertainment around the corner, so let's go check that out. <laughs> Found some little friends. This is why I love Animal Kingdom so much. They wish to say, like, we'll see you look up there. Look at how cute they are and just swinging around. We've never actually seen them active over here, so this is really special for us. Alrighty friends, we're gonna make a little Joffrey's pit stop. Let you know what we get. Alrighty friends, so we already tried it, but we went to Joffrey's. I got the lion's latte with oat milk. This is like a white chocolate with coconut on it. It looks really good. It is really good. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've already tasted it. Yeah. If you watch all ears, then you know, but it's definitely magic today. <laughs> Same thing with the ice white mocha. I get this all the time. It is always magic. <laughs> our way over to Rafiki's Planet Watch and kind of show you guys everything there is to do over there. Okay, so Kyle just found this leaf with a hidden Mickey in it. How awesome is that? It's like that was perfect timing. Alright, so we have made it to Rafiki's Planet Watch and we're doing a little backyard scavenger hunt. So let's try to find some of these animals. A dragonfly and um, ants, right? Got our dragonfly and the ants right here. Alright, we found our little froggy friend. Got a frog. Alright, we found our little tortoise friend over here drinking some water. All right, there's the tarantula down there. We got another little friend up here. Okay, found our little bumblebee. Right next to our bee, we found our little bunny friend down here. All right, here's our little caterpillar, as well as the bat. All right, we also found the butterfly hiding down here. All right, so we're right back here by the dragonfly, and we actually missed the little ladybug hiding up here in the tree. Last but not least, probably hidden the best, over here we have the flying mantis. So with that, we have completed our little scavenger hunt. <laughs> Let's go get our prize. All right, so as you complete them, you get the little completer sticker up here. So let's keep going. Batch. Sorry, Batch. Jesus. We have Rafiki here greeting us. We have about 30 minutes to the next animation station. So we're going to just hang out and wait till then. All right, we have made it. So let's head inside and do some exploring.
So I'm not sure that we're gonna go to complete all of our badges today, but if you are looking to, this is gonna show you where you need to go. Okay, and we will be doing this next, but this is where you're gonna find the animation station where you can draw some of your favorite characters. All right, so as you walk in to sit down, you're gonna grab your paper, your pencil, and they'll have the clipboards waiting for you. We are gonna be doing Dumbo, so I'm super excited for that. Magic of nature. Walt Disney himself understood the importance of spending time around animals, studying their behavior and personalities in order to create realistic characters and dynamic storylines. This meeting of the human and animal worlds sparked a legacy of storytelling that has shaped our relationship with animals and conservation forever. Today, we invite you to become a part of that legacy as our own Disney artists help you learn to sketch characters inspired by the very animals found here at Disney's Animal Kingdom. I'm the one and only Dumbo. Dumbo. All right, such excitement. Now, to make sure we can draw him, we do need something important, which is inspiration. And what I would love, I would love to bring in an elephant in here. That's gonna be a little bit too complicated. But you can look at them over at the safari. So let's inspire you in a different way. You see here at the Seas Animal Kingdom, we really care about these animals. And one of the ways that we do so is through the Disney Conservation Fund. So we're gonna show you a little bit about that. Now, are we ready to be inspired? Yeah. <laughs> All right, look up the screens. We thrill us. us laugh and to make us cry they make us think she's beautiful inspire us and teach us when they are walking you know how you see they have like a rounded pad but it's kind of like our hands and they're basically walking to the boat gonna make this almost like butterfly wings but first we gotta mark in some letter c's now then on my table once we exit on the right where everybody all right so we just finished our little dumbo drawings and when you come outside they do have a little petting area so your little ones or even you can cut some of the animals and get up close and personal got the goat over here big chillin all right, so we made it over to Flame Tree Barbecue, and I got the classic baked mac and cheese with pulled pork. That's my go-to every time we're in Animal Kingdom. I love it. Kyle actually got the half a chicken with fries and coleslaw. That's something new he's going to try. So, Flame Tree Barbecue, I got the half chicken, and I got it with french fries instead of baked beans, because I don't like baked beans and coleslaw. This chicken is huge, and it looks delicious. I guess let's just dive right into it. I believe it was thirteen ninety nine yes. for the chicken, and it's twelve forty nine for the mac and cheese. Let's see here. First bite of chicken. Mm. Wow. Okay. I know it's kind of far fetched, but this chicken is really good super tender super flavorful the the rub that's on the outside of it is like full of flavor it's super smoky it reminds me so much of the old chicken that i used to get at the monsters cafe at universal so it's like nostalgia in my heart this is really good solid nine out of ten i'll get this again every time all right so now as you guys can see this is the same exact area we were sitting in this morning when there was absolutely nobody because flame tree was closed and now it's packed everywhere you look so if you want to have somewhere to eat breakfast <laughs> definitely check out this seating area but we're finishing up our lunch we killed that yeah flame tree barbecue is so good like we were just talking about our favorite barbecue place and we just ate at round i almost called it toy stories roundup rodeo but roundup rodeo barbecue and low-key 
the experience at Roundup Rodeo Barbecue was amazing, and they have like the different cuts of meats and stuff where they were really good. But this chicken and this pulled pork at Flame Barbecue is killer. Like we will like it's hard to pick somewhere else to eat at the Animal Kingdom because it's this is so good. So like besides Santilli Canteen. Yeah, I was about to say that literally took a word right out of our mouth. It's usually this or Santilli Canteen for us, but this nine times out of ten for sure. Alrighty friends, so I think that wraps up our day here at Animal Kingdom. We had so much fun. Yes, yeah, so the Freakness Planet Watch was amazing. <laughs> Doing all the drawing and stuff was fantastic. I cannot yeah. wait to come back and try that out again. We more and draw many more characters. Yeah. They also have a special on Disney Plus too that you can do them at home. So we're definitely gonna do that and we'll show you guys whenever we do that. For sure. But if you like this video, give us a like, a comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell notification button. And we'll see you guys next time. Love you bye. bye.